Let's go, let's go, man. Let's get into it. Shout out to LeBron James and the LA Lakers for winning this series. And honestly, it's safe to say LeBron James owns Steph Curry. I mean, it is what it is. LeBron James owns Steph Curry. You know, I mean, which is not shocking. I mean, LeBron James clearly had the better team. You know, it is what it is. Let me say this about the Warriors. First of all, Clay Thompson's washed. I don't care what anybody says. Clay Thompson is washed. All I heard today was, oh, you know, Clay Thompson, Clay, uh, game six, Clay Thompson, game six, Clay Thompson. Dude was like two for 15 from three. Clay Thompson is garbage. And Clay, it's either time to retire or come off the bench. It's, it's one of those two. It's one of those two. Because Curry, you didn't shoot the best, but at the same time, Listen, I'm not even mad at Curry. Curry had to shoot the shots because, let's be for real, Jordan Poole had, like, zero points throughout, like, the first. Jordan Poole only had, like, five points. Clay is washed. Draymond can't score on a five, fifth grader. Uh, who else is on that team? I, I don't know. Some other, you know, the Rams can't do anything. So, Steph Curry had 32 points, 11 for 22 from the field, five assists, six rebounds. I mean, Curry... You put up 30. I can't be mad at Curry. Curry had to put up shots. It's the same thing back with like James Harden back in 2018 when uh, Chris Paul got injured and he went like seven for 27 from three. He's the only one that could put up shots. So, you know, it is what it is. Curry, you did your best, but Curry, it's time to go to management, slap the management, and either try to trade Clay Thompson or put him on the bench. Do something. Do something. Get rid of Jordan Poole. Do something. Keep Draymond. Do something. And as it goes for Draymond Green, I think Draymond Green's gone. I think Draymond Green's going to go into a different team unless uh, they offer him a huge bag, which is not out the possibility of the realm, but we're going to find out about that. But shout out to the Golden State Warriors. Now on to LeBron James. LeBron. 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 We, the NBA needs you. I need you. Because that disgusting franchise out there in Boston who will be nameless is probably going to win the East. Most likely going to win the East. I'm recording this after the Golden State game and I'm posting this on Saturday. We need you to own Boston. We need you to own Boston. We need this. I need this. Like, we can't see the Boston Celtics win this, this finals, man. We can't let them see this, man. Like I can't, I can't bear to watch the Celtics win this uh, finals. At the end of the day, listen, Bron. I seen you done. I see you do it again. I seen you done it multiple times. Do this, man. Back with the Heat when you used to own the Celtics. Back with the Heat when you used to own the Celtics. This celebration with the Miami Heat that you used to do. I need you to do this in a Lakers jersey. I need you to strangle the heat and strangle the Celtics. Because Joel Embiid and James Harden, Doc Rivers can't do it. So, Bron, why not it be you? Why not it be you? I made a video. You should go check it out. Calling out Kawhi Leonard, Giannis, LeBron, Steph Curry saying, you guys are Kevin Durant also saying you guys are the superstars in the NBA. I expect you to go to the finals and win. KD eliminated, Steph Curry now eliminated, Giannis eliminated, Kawhi eliminated. LeBron, you're the last superstar I consider a superstar in the NBA. A guy who's won an MVP, a guy who's been in conversations for Defensive Player of the Year awards, which you should have won back in 2011, but it is what it is, and a guy who's won multiple championships and won multiple finals MVPs. We need you to beat the Celtics. We need it. We need it because no one wants to see Boston win. Curry, Curry, you're cool and all, Curry, but at the same time, Curry, you weren't going to beat the Celtics. Klay Thompson's a corpse. Draymond can be one of the most smartest people on the basketball court, but then turn into the one of the most dumbest people on the basketball court. Jordan Poole, no. 
Jordan Poole, no. He got punched out by Draymond. And Steve Kerr is vastly overrated. Vastly overrated. So even if you guys went up against Golden State, I mean, not Golden State, if you guys would have went up against Boston, you guys would have get clapped. But this man right here, LeBron James, we need you, bro. We need you, bro. I need you. Whoop on the Celtics. I can't bear to see that disgusting franchise to win. Let them still sit in misery. But as it goes for this series, look, at the end of the day, Golden State, you didn't come to compete in this series. You came to compete for a few games, and when the Lakers play their game, the Lakers play their game. So, you know, at the end of the day, man, it is what it is. LeBron, we need you. The NBA needs you. Real basketball fans need you. But let me know your thoughts on this series. Let me know your thoughts on LeBron and Curry. And I think this puts, I think this, you know, puts the end to, to this debate. You know, LeBron's better than Curry. I mean, everybody knew LeBron's better than Curry. Anybody who, that had Curry above LeBron, I mean, is either a Curry sexual or an idiot or a, or a LeBron hater. Everybody knew LeBron James is above Curry. But at the same time, man, shout out to LeBron. You own Steph Curry. You own the West. I need you to I need you to own the West and East by beating the Celtics like you always did back in 2010s. That's my thoughts. What are yours? RJ out.